Hello everyone, in this video we will solve a nice algebraic expression a square minus v is equal to 30, b square minus a is equal to 30. We will find out what is the value of a and b in this mass Olympiad question. It is a nice mass Olympiad question. So I can say it is a, our first equation and this is our second equation. It's okay. Uh, solution. First of all, I subtract first equation and second equation. So I take here first equation minus second equation. So it will be this minus this. It will be a square minus b minus v square minus a is equal to in this expression here 30 minus 30. I subtract both equation. Now I can see that here is a square minus v plus minus it will be minus v square minus minus it will be plus a is equal to 0 30 minus 30 it will be 0 then if I move on this b square in this side here so a square minus v square and here is positive a and this is negative v is equal to 0 then we know that a square minus v square this identity it will be a plus v times a minus b according to this law i can see this expression a plus b times a minus b and in this expression you can see that here is plus one is common so it will be a minus b is equal to zero now i can see easily here is a minus b this is a minus b so i take a minus b is common so this divide this it will be a plus v and this divide this it will be positive one is equal to zero so we'll find out here's two case our first case is a minus v is equal to zero so i take our first case a minus b is equal to zero and other case a plus v plus one is equal to zero now i can see easily here is a is equal to b i just move on this b in this side and i can say it is our third equation and here i can say it will be a is equal to minus b minus one this is our fourth equation now at this point here is a and v is equal so i take our first equation recall our first equation it will be a square minus v is equal to 30 so i take this equation here so it will be a square minus b is equal to 30. now i put on this value a is equal to v so i can say that it will be v square minus b negative 30 is equal to 0 i just move on this positive 30 in this height it will be negative 30. now here is factorization is possible here is middle factor i take uh, 6b and 5b so i can say that it will be b square minus 6b minus minus it will be positive 5b minus 30 is equal to 0. <coughs> because of that look here 6b plus 5b it will be negative v and 6 times 5 it will be 30. now i can say that here is v is common so b square divide b it will be b 6b divide b it will be 6 and I take here is 5 is common, so b minus 6 is equal to 0. Then you can see that here is b minus c, 6 is common, so it will be b minus 6, then this plus this, b plus 5 is equal to 0. Now I can see that here is 2 case or first case b minus 6 is equal to 0, and other case b plus 5 is equal to 0. Now at this moment you can see that here is b is equal to 6 and v is equal to negative 5 but recall our third equation is a is equal to v look here is third equation so i can say a is equal to b this is our third equation so according to this case this equation i can say a v both are same when v is equal to 6 this time a is equal to 6 when v is equal to negative 5 this time a is equal to negative 5 so this is our final answer in this mass olympiad question but other case look here 
uh, a plus v plus 1 is equal to 0 and we we'll find out here is a is equal to negative v negative 1 it's okay but recall our first equation is a square minus b is equal to 30 i take this equation again so it will be a square minus v is equal to 30 this is our first equation now at this moment uh, in this expression i we know that a is equal to minus b minus 1 so i take this value here so this equation it will be minus b minus 1 whole to the power 2 minus b is equal to 30 so okay now i consider it will be positive because of that here is even number so it will be b plus 1 whole to the power 2 i take here is negative 1 is common so 1 to the power 2 it will be positive 1 minus 1 to the power 2 it will be positive 1 so i consider it minus b minus 1 whole to the power 2 it will be b plus 1 whole to the power 2 minus b is equal to 30 then at this moment you can see easily a plus b whole square so it will be s square plus 2ab plus b square minus b minus 30 is equal to 0 and here v square plus v to 2v to minus v it will be v and i consider it 30 minus 1 it will be minus 29 is equal to 0 but at this moment v is equal to what in this expression so at this moment i consider here is a is equal to 1 and v is equal to also 1 and c is equal to minus 29 if i compare uh, ax square plus bx plus c this time we know that here is a is equal to 1 b is equal to here is 1 and c is equal to minus 29 so here v is equal to you know that this formula it will be negative v plus minus square root b square minus 4ac over 2a i take this formula I write down this formula in this here so this case it will be v is equal to minus b b it will be negative 1 plus minus square root b square 1 square minus 4 a c a is 1 c is minus 29 over 2 a a is 1 now here <coughs> i can say that it will be b b is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root 1 and minus minus it will be plus and 4 times 29 it will be 116 over 2 now if i evaluate this expression i can say v is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root 170 over 2 then this is our final answer this is the value of v but if you evaluate this expression i can see it will be minus 1 and this radical expression it will be square root 117 it will be uh, 9 times 13 over 2 then i can say here is v is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root 9 it will be 3 and here is square root 13 over 2 so we are find out here is b is equal to minus 1 plus minus 3 square root 13 over 2 this is the value of b in this equation the our equation it will be a plus v plus 1 is equal to 0 and we are find out here is a is equal to negative v negative 1 this is our fourth equation but we find out here is v is equal to this blue so a is equal to what so i take here is a minus b it will be minus v is minus 1 plus minus 3 square root 13 over 2 minus 1 now if i evaluate it we are find out here is a is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root 13 over 2 i mean here is uh, a is equal to first of all we are find out a is equal to minus 1 minus 3 square root 13 over 2 and when we are take negative value this time we are find out here is a is equal to minus 1 plus 3 square root 13 over 2 so we are fi find out our final answer when uh, we are take positive value uh, uh, b value this time we are find out here is negative value and when, when we are take a is equal to negative value this time we are find out here is positive value so i can say that here is our final answer is uh, minus 1 plus minus 3 square root 13 over 2 and here is minus 1 minus plus 3 square root 13 over 2 so this is our final answer in this maths olympiad question thank you all if you enjoy this video 
to subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care